right guys you already see where we're at we're up here in Hinton at the at the dam and I'm gonna try to catch a musky here I'll be having a musky rod with me about everywhere I go from now on I got me a half-ass musky rod rigged up here guys it's a uh, I got an Abu Garcia 6500 C3 I got a 7.6 heavy action die with Jupiter rod. We're going to start out with a top water plug. And this is one that Eric gave me for my birthday. And it is called a Big Mama Psycho Sister. It's like a big giant whopper plopper. They got three gates open, the water's moving. So, uh, big old. Whopper ploppers, all it is. Can't really do no figure eight off the bank. Oh, that's, that's pretty. It's a glide like you got. Yeah. But uh, I got a box with this. It's made by a guy in West Virginia down in What's like, too? That's yeah, a good on that killer, man. Appreciate it. Look there, guys. Eric's the musky man. This is called the Narcan. We're going to bring them to life. From my addiction tackle. That's a cool name, Narcan. For any of y'all that don't know what Narcan is, it's what they give people when they overdose on drugs to bring them back to life. We're getting ready to do to a muskie right here. We're getting ready to bring one back to life. Yeah, yeah man, that feels good on this rod here. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's how you get around the river right there. Got our carp rod set up. Guys, there's right here's another thing I like about these stands. Like I said, they're the extra tall stands. But I might not be able to get them in the ground back here. You just come right out here, stick them bad boys in the ground right here in the water. And I can carry them on out there to where they ain't nothing sticking up out of the water, but you know, but the real part, you know, hell I can I can put them four foot deep. We got giant carp showing herself everywhere and uh, all kinds of fish jumping and splashing. So I'm going to throw this x wrap a little bit. Here in a minute, one of them rods right there is going to stand straight up and go to squalling. There's two or three carp right up here, just right up here, fucking 20 pounds. Giants just swimming around feeding. You can see them playing today. I could probably throw a, a, a crankbait in here. Look here. There we go. Ah. God almighty. Ah. Now that's what I like about them rod holders right there. This could be a giant here, guys. Liable to be a giant carp. Big old carp, big old slobber head. Oh, 
I, I, I don't know. Big black one. Nice fish. Yeah, big old carp. Man, you're talking about stout in this current. He was going straight down the river. These things just feel huge, man, in this current. I think he's, yeah, I think he's a teenager, maybe. <laughs> Super stout, man. You know? Come here, buddy. We're going to turn you loose here in a second. There we go. Yeah, he's heavier than he looks, ain't he? He's a teenager, ain't he? Fat boy. Yeah, baby. Oh, At 15, I'd say, ain't he? Oh, yeah. That's what I'm talking about. Them people just had walked off, too. <laughs> you know what? Guys, right there is why I like those stands. Big old head on him. There. Hook went through his face and in the net. Easy, buddy. Easy, buddy. We're going to turn you loose here in a second. There's a big sandstone fall slobber head fell. It's probably about 15 pounds. Something like that. They're all in here, man. And I'll take advantage of them. Caught on soybean meal, flour, and corn. Nice fish. Nice fish there, fellas. I'll catch them all day long. I don't care one bit to catch these carp. Go on back down there, we'll catch you again. Hell yeah. Soybean meal and corn and flour, boys. Simple, simple, simple hog dough. That bad boy in the stand. That's it. Wait on a run. Bake this and back up. And I'm using uh, gulp corn maize, guys, for pickups. Put them up on your hook, better than real corn because they last forever. Now, a handful of this dough, pack it around that. A lot of guys use uh, method lead to do this with, but I don't need them. Pack it around my hook. Pack it around my hook. I pack so many dough balls that method lead's a waste of money for me, man. I don't need them. I don't need to pay all that money for something to stuff a dough ball into. That dough will pack around there like that right there. Pretty little dough ball. A couple minutes it'll soak off. And this current washes it around in there real good. And then it's on. There we go, there we go. There's a small mouth. Me under the rocks. There we go, little buddy. As soon as it hit the water. 
That'll work. Hell yeah. Nothing big, but look where I caught him. That makes it even better, guys. Out of here. All right, guys, Eric's got one there. I was up here trying to catch a bass. Carp number two. Get him, boy. That's a good one there, son. Yeah. Told you when I walked off, you'd get a run. I called it, buddy. Pretty fish. I thought it was the same one. Look at that. I think it's a dark one. Same rod though, ain't it? Yeah. Beautiful fish. Let me have your rod. Alright. Here we go. <laughs> Hell yeah. Good deal, man.